What is going on guys? Jay Rico here. Hope you guys are having a great day as of today. As you guys can see from today's topic of the video guys, we're gonna be discussing the number one mistake that turned men into simps. Guys, I've been getting a lot of DMs, a lot of messages on Instagram, on YouTube in regards to what do I do with this girl, what do I do with that girl? And guys, let me tell you something. These questions are pretty much basically the same exact thing. It's the same exact thing. How do I get the woman back? How do I actually get her to like me back or so? How do I get her to do this? How do I get her to do that? First of all, guys, the mistake that I see that you guys are making that I have personally have made before, you guys care too much in regards to what women think about you or what that specific woman actually thinks about you or so guys that's the number one mistake you guys are making as of right now that's killing your confidence this is the thing that's turning you into a simp now this is with people in general there are some people that are gonna like you there are some people that are not gonna like you and hey guess what because each and every person that I have met, we all have our own differences, guys. I have my own differences. There's still people that I'm still that I'm still cool with that I still hang out with, whether if it's a guy or whether if it's a girl. If they say something and I disagree with that, I'll tell them, hey, like, hey, I appreciate your opinion or I appreciate your point, but I disagree on you. I I, I disagree with you on that. I disagree with you on that. Like I can't see eye to eye on that here for you. And then I'll tell them the reason why and I'll tell them my opinion and we'll go on about our day. That's it. We'll still be talking. We'll still be friends at the end of the day and regardless with women as well, guys. A lot of you guys are literally stuck on this one specific girl that may not even like you at the end of the day, guys. You guys are literally so caught up in this one specific chick, guys. The main reason as to why I was able to get women, why I'm able to get women, and why whenever they actually do meet me, they see, wow, this guy, literally, looks like he doesn't give a fuck, but it's not that I don't give a fuck, guys. It's about who I give a fuck about, who I truly care about at the end of the day, guys. Most of these women, guys, nowadays, you shouldn't even care about them or so, and I'm just saying, speaking from my actual experience or so, guys, because honestly, hey, they could literally be in your life one day, the next day, or they'll be gone just like that here for yourself. This is the reason why I live by myself. I live by my own house, my own rules, whatever you want to call it, guys, because I'm adapting to what I'm currently doing as of right now. There's people out there that probably don't even like me, but guess what, guys? At the end of the day, I could care less. As long as I'm doing what I actually do care about the most and as long as I actually enjoy what I'm guys what I'm actually doing guys, I'm okay with that. Most of you guys are literally worried about, oh, does this girl like me or does this girl like me or does this girl literally block me? This girl literally hasn't sent me a message back yet or so. What's going on? What should I do? Guys, don't do anything. Don't do anything. I'm going to give you guys a little example here. There's this one specific chick that I actually did, I guess, uh, whenever I had Tinder or so, when, that I actually did message back on Tinder during the time. She got her phone, I got her phone number. We started texting a bit. We set up a time and a place for us to meet up, guys. She actually confirmed that time and the place, said that it was okay. On that day, three, four hours earlier before the actual date, or whatever you wanna call it, guys, she says, hey, can we reschedule for this other date? It's too late. I feel like it's too late for me. You know what I did, guys? I didn't even give two shits. I left her on red for that reason. If a woman tries to reschedule, I leave it like that. And then guess what, guys? Guess what happens? i like, all right, cool. I'm not going to message her anymore. Hey, I'm going to let her message me. I'm going to let her wait until she messages me. And guess what happens, guys? Literally a week ago, I get a message from this one specific girl telling her, hey, like, hey, I need a photo because I definitely don't remember you. She sends, sends me a photo and I know exactly who this girl was the moment she actually sent me the photo, guys. And she says, oh, hey, uh, you remember me now for leaving me on red? Like, I do remember. And she went straight to the point. Hey, 
when can you come over to my place? Just for the fact that she actually saw that I didn't even care. I didn't even care regardless if she says like, hey, let's reschedule guys. When it comes to dates for me specifically guys, if there's a time and a place that we're gonna meet up and you actually try to reschedule literally at the last minute, at the last minute, last minute, me knowing that I've already got everything all set up for that specific date, whether it's a time or place or whatever, and you actually try to reschedule at the last minute, guys, um, hey, that's definitely a no-go for me here for you guys. This is why I do tell you guys, most of these women, they don't care about your time, they don't care about your actual, what you actually have going on in your life here for you. So whenever I'm at the gym, guys, whenever I'm literally working on myself, I don't care about who else is literally watching me. As long as I'm focused on my goals that I actually do have, as long as I'm focused on my job, in order for you to be, be the best version that I could actually be, as long as I'm going to the gym, trying my hardest that day or so, guys, that's all that really matters. But most of you guys literally are so into this one specific little detail that honestly doesn't even matter. If a girl blocks you, if a girl does this, hey, I made videos in regards to this or so, yes, that is true, guys, but hey, at the end of the day, you shouldn't even care about it. You're wasting your precious time in little stuff that doesn't even matter at the end of the day, guys. This is why I'm telling you, I know from experience, there has been several years back ago where I literally was caught up in my ex and I would always be wondering or curious as to what is she's doing, who is she with, or where is she going or so, guys. And what did that lead me to? Nothing. Did I get her back? Yo, I'm by myself, guys. I definitely did it. And, and guess what, guys? It's okay. It's okay. We have our own losses and we, are, we, we also have our own wins, guys. Don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it. The whole actual purpose of the video, guys, was just to let you guys know is that don't care in regards to women. Don't care too much because most of you guys literally care way too much in regards to women actually does think about you or what a, what a woman actually says to you or so, guys. Guys, because at the end of the day, as long as you, you are making yourself happy, guys, that's all that really matters here for you. And trust me, guys, when you guys don't even give a fuck and you guys are working on yourself, women are going to secretly see that and they're going to get turned on by that, guys. And literally, they're either going to talk to you sooner or later. And that's it for us of today's video, guys. If you guys did like my video as of today, I would appreciate you guys if you guys did hit the like down below. Any questions, any comments in the comment section down below here for you. Guys, make sure to follow me on Instagram, J underscore Rico. 92. I'll see you guys in the next one. And also subscribe to my YouTube channel for more content. Take care.